In this series, I will be challenging a fellow YouTuber to a GOAT format duel. But this won't be just any GOAT format duel. Each player will spin a wheel that will determine how the decks can be built using only GOAT format era cards. These restrictions range from certain packs to open, to only allowing the use of common cards, and many more. After each player builds a deck, we duel. Who will be the wheeled goat of Yugi Tube? You'll just have to watch the series to find out. What's up, guys? We are back with another episode of Wheeled Goat, and this week we have the legendary DZ on, and we are going to be spinning the Wheel of Wheels to see which we will be using. I think have we spun wheel? Uh, you know, I think we've spun all the wheels now. Uh, let's let's try it out. I don't know which one I'm even hoping for at this point, but let's see what we can land on. Oh, we're going back to the OG. We're going back to OG wheel number one. There's getting pretty low amount of uh, options on this wheel. So let's see what we can even get at this point. Let's see what we spin. Hopefully something good. One of every, one of any card would be pretty interesting. Using only G goat format starter decks. Okay, I think we can make a pretty good deck out of this. It's still going to be singleton spell and traps, but we'll definitely be able to get some decent spell traps. Probably some pretty good monsters out of here. We're going to have to figure out what we can make. I'm going to head over to Twitch, twitch.tv slash ruxin34. If you want to be there on Mondays for Master Duel Monday, you can help me build my deck for the next episodes. So check that out. That's where I'm headed right now. I might not know a lot about GOAT formats, but I do know a little something about spinning wheels. So today I plan on taking Ruxin down. Let's spin that wheel. Let's see what we're working with today. I'm hoping it's not something too unplayable, but I want it to be fun. So what do we have? Deck using only fiends. Is that what that is? It's an F. Deck using only fiend type. Okay, so let's jump into the deck building. I'm going to see what I can make. I feel like there are a number of good fiends in goat control, so I think our deck should look all right, but let's take a look. All right, so here's the deck. I think it's looking pretty good. We were able to kind of build an Archfiend deck, at least with the good Archfiend cards. We have three copies of Archfiend Soldier, three copies of Shadow Knight Archfiend, alongside uh, three copies of Falling Down. This is essentially a Snatch Deal, so we kind of have four copies of Snatch Deal, and we even have an extra copy of uh, Call the Haunted here with two copies of Archfiend's Roar. That being said, I think the rest of the deck is looking pretty good too. We have Slate Warrior for damage, 1900 attack points, and a pretty good effect if it's destroyed by battle we have giant germ to do damage and kind of flood the board and we have a bunch of great trap and spell cards too one card i wanted to highlight was bark of dark ruler i am planning on paying a ton of life points with this card to kind of surprise ruxin and get a lot of damage on him when he least expects it that being said, I am a bit shaky with GOAT format in general, so he probably has a better understanding of that. So let's jump into the duels and see how it goes. All right, here's what we built for Wheeled GOAT episode 13. And honestly, we got really lucky with our spin. We got starter decks, structure decks, and they're only a couple structure decks, but they're absolutely insane. And then the starter decks just add a couple of great cards that you need to throw in. So this is what we came up with. We have a giant soldier of stone. That's just basically for giant rat if we need to wall up. We have three luster dragons because it's a 1900 attacker, pretty strong. We've got a Maneater Bug, we've got Sangin, three Spirit Reaper, that's just annoying to deal with in Go format, three Wall of Illusion, another annoying card, two Giant Rat, because they're going to be able to find cool stuff like the Giant Soldier of Stone, like our Pyramid Turtle, which will also be able to go into our Ryu Kokis and our Vampire Lord, so our monsters are pretty strong. Then we have all our awesome staples, plus we added Book of Life, because obviously, I mean, technically I could argue this goes with the strategy, but it's a really strong card, so I didn't want to throw in more than one, because it's just ridiculous with zombies, so I... I, I I kept it to one versus like when we did this field spell the other day. A little bit different with that. Snatch Steel, um, anything different. I did do a Rush Recklessly because there are a lot of power staples in here, but we are missing some of the normal ones. There's no like widespread ruin and stuff like that. So I did Rush Recklessly because damage step kind of shenanigans can be really annoying and really powerful if they don't know you have them. Then there's some other good stuff like Curse of Anubis is one we don't normally play, but it can be pretty relevant. Uh, Shadow Spell is another nice card. I figured out this is what... When we were doing the testing, we were at a Spirit Reaper uh, mirror match. It was kind of insane, so it was just like outing Spirit Reaper. This out Spirit Reaper because it's targets. So overall, a pretty strong deck, and I feel really confident about us having a chance to win. Let's get to the duel. Welcome back to Wheeled Goat episode 13, and we finally got the king of wheels onto Wheeled Goat, Dezith. Hello, I think that is pronounced... <laughs> Dezif. Might probably not just to not get roasted by the comments. Just to, if you wanted to do that. Starting off on a hot note, the Ziff. Welcome back to Wheel Goat episode 13. 
we have grabbed the king of wheels himself because we started a series with wheels you have to have the king of wheels on here dz and no it's not dz which i said as a joke in the first intro but then it got confusing so we know it's dz and it's now in the video i am the wheel master uh thank you so much for inviting me to spin a wheel there is nothing that i would rather do with an afternoon beautiful that is what i want to hear so look you you either mind game to me or you told me your deck we're gonna find out very soon so let's just begin the duel and see if you're actually on the fiend deck or if that was all a big bluff and a genius wheel move i would never ruin the sanctity of the goat wheel okay so okay. yeah if i want to go first i choose second you go second okay. yes yes you there definitely we. do want to do that yeah so please konami add uh <laughs> i don't know that'd probably be too weird to program right yeah too weird i guess i mean it's been a long time i guess it was no too hard. way you're showing up with the basic field here i am disappointed <laughs> in you Look, you're playing a basic person, and that is me. So I'm going to pass oh it right to you. Gosh. Let you get your first card. I come out here. I've planned my outfit and everything, and this is what you bring? Look, okay, you, you okay. look fantastic. That's all I can say. I normal summon Archfiend Soldier. Oh, that is a big card. Watch out. He's an expert at battle. And then I will set a card and pass to you. Classic. Well, you did say fiends, and you played a fiend. So I'm feeling pretty strongly you didn't lie to me. That's nice i guess um i would never lie to you oh wow this is uh that's a big monster okay yeah, it's, it's a, a big, big vanilla monster. gemini elf territory over here hey back in 2005 that's not too bad um <laughs> you know i'm just gonna i'm just gonna settle down over here and not get too crazy okay well i'm just gonna tell you right now this defensive attitude is not gonna work <laughs> you need to be aggressive also thank you deck for giving okay. me this wonderful draw i drew for turn oh! nobleman cross oh, out targeting your face down let's hit a flip monster my giant soldier of stone huh <laughs> okay okay we're cooking no, uh, you let's normal these. summon well, now you have one. Oh, it fell down the hole okay fair the trap hole rest in peace arching soldier that's okay i would have felt good about having a, a big 2k defender against this guy but... yeah that was actually um i don't know if i had too many outs to that besides the <laughs> noble man which is that's... not uh great to say in this matchup because you're probably gonna have a couple more copies of that i mean did yeah. you roll rock i mean what other are there even enough rock monsters in goat format maybe i'm feeling a i'm feeling a little not good about this right now so i'm just gonna set one. <laughs> oh man you gotta uh, do something man. else actually i gotta I just, do something else archfiend soldier is a little bit too powerful for me yeah no i'm i'm running you out of cards here um i actually did play against a pretty strong rock deck and goat the other day so maybe you could be cooking something let's see what we have face maybe oh okay i think i have figured it out i believe you are on earth monsters i guess we'll find out let's bring this guy out oh yes yes okay so you have like six floaters for free that's pretty strong not gonna lie i will set one oh setting cards so many cards being set and pass hey i got all good stuff back here don't you worry about it oh there we go okay we've, we've we've gotten a good card we've gotten a good card yeah let's start off with this other good card i have and let's see what you got back there oh yeah that's pretty good ah oh, man maybe i should have held on to that oh well oh bark of dark ruler yeah it's a Game funny one battles. it's a silly one. Oh, uh, during the damage set pay life points and multiples then target and they oh wow yeah <laughs> wait you get to pick the number yeah i can just pay whatever whoa that's kind of insane okay yeah that's that's pretty strong okay mirror wall i'm a big mirror wall fan i know it's not that amazing but i do like it i think it's you good. know it is amazing though oh my god what were you <laughs> you were just sitting on these cards oh <laughs> uh, no i just drew this one um i was sitting on heavy storm uh yeah that's fair it seems like you're not setting too many cards you know what i don't feel like holding this for forever um vampire lord okay now, now you're I'm confused confused about what i'm playing huh? yeah now i'm very <laughs> confused but okay i'm with you i think we'll get rid of this too this is just um, a random assortment of monster cards. Yeah, let me just... Uh... Oh, okay, okay. I love Goat Format. Goat Format is my favorite. Luckily, there's no Delinquent Duo available in Master. Yeah, yeah. Well, I am glad they took that one out. Well, I don't like tributing this, but I do need to get over this big guy. Ryu Koki. He's a big guy. Here we go. That's what you want to summon with the turtle, not tribute yeah, summon. Yeah. 
Oh, well. I know. It's not great. It's what not could great. What you possibly have right here? We got fiends. We got zombies. We got earth. We got dark. See, the problem <laughs> is you've built the wheel, so you know yeah, I everything know all the options. about it. Yeah. That's true. Um, you, you might not have read the last option. It's it's a little different. I mean, what really can you like do here? I, I don't know. I'm just going to pass. Well, okay. I'm going to throw a card face down, technically, but I am just going to pass. <laughs> okay. The question is... Do you play Mirror Force is the question. Do I play Mirror Force? Is that a question in GOAT format? Not really. The question is, did you play it just Draw now? It. That is the yes, real question. Yes. Yeah, uh, I think I'm going to high roll for this thing and see what happens. Oh, sh**. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to try for it. Yeah, you called it. You called it. No. <laughs> oh, no, that's unfortunate. Mirror Force Dang, activate. <laughs> Cool animation. Got a little greedy. Okay, I had to try. I had to try it. I had to try it. Your deck seems okay, pretty good. Are... I'm not gonna lie. Uh, a little scared, but I'm sure I can figure it out. <sighs> I didn't get to make you really pay for it. You had the answer. Okay, 61. That's not great. Okay. Little do you know, Archfiend Soldier, 1900, eh, not so bad. But have you seen Shadow Knight Archfiend, 2,000 <laughs> oh attack points on a normal summonable monster? And he has to pay 900. Yeah, yeah all... the pain. I mean, yeah, who whatever. Needs to... You got plenty of life points. It's fine. What's this other effect do, though? Or something? Oh, that yeah. It's real scorn. funny. Yeah. You have a one in six chance of negating the to targeting negate? effect. And it would only take half damage. Okay. That's. This has got a lot of effects, man. Three yeah, effects also, on that Dark yeah. Crisis card. That's uh, nuts. You know, those. It's, it is at least like one of the only good Archfiend cards out there. So I'm I mean, that is it, pretty but. strong. I mean, if a one in six chance in a negate is better than a 0% chance in a negate. So. Exactly. That's just a bonus effect. It doesn't even need that. Yeah, that's true. Oh, interesting. That's not what I like to hear. I'm going to just uh, settle down because you that's all seem to have does. large monsters, which is tough. You just keep settling over there. I'm trying to have a nice, clean game. All right, let's let's take 900. Yeah, take it. I, look, this is my strategy. Let's let you have this guy. That's honestly not a bad idea. Uh, I am on a <laughs> clock here. You're on a clock. Okay, yeah. Let, let's let's flip that over. Yeah, 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 turtle. Yeah. Fair enough. Bring our boy out. Let's see if you got anything for this. Ryu Koki again. Let's He's go back for more. Um, that guy's pretty big. Yeah. I will, I hate using this like this, but I will activate falling down. Oh, take control? Yeah, of this guy's about to fall down into my board. <laughs> oh no, that's a problem. Uh, go ahead. Oh no, during each of your opponent's standby phases, you take 800 damage? Okay. Yeah, the, you know, the damage <laughs> might be added up here, but as long you, as I finish the got, game. You've got your own Glock going here, okay? Yeah. I can do it. So it's going like one on your turn, one on my turn, okay. Yeah, no, I'm on a pretty tight clock, but luckily <laughs> I have 2,000 attack. God, you have so many floaters. This is just going to be giant rat again. Let's eh, just settle fine. down, that's settle fine. back. I mean, you're doing all the work for me. I don't really have to no, do too, no, too much no. here. To, if you want this kind of power, you have to be willing to sacrifice some life points, you know? That's true. We're That's cracking fair. eggs. We're making omelets. Okay, let's go battle. Okay. Good luck. 2K. Please don't have Giant Soldier's Stone. I don't. Ah, very interesting. Very interesting. Do you have a target? <laughs> if this was GOAT format, I would. And I'll leave it at that. Oh, interesting. This I don't know why I'm attacking this. It was to BM you, but also in this format, there's like also I I guess I figured if you had mere force, you would have used it, but you could have had Sakuratsu armor. The Sakuratsu armor, yeah. that would have been a punish for that. Yeah. You know, we're just we're activating cards. Things are happening. Activating cards, you know. Chill. Well, look, the okay. other day I tried to premature burial of Spirit Reaper, so I've done a few things in my day. Don't don't oh, do, don't you worry. Oh, uh, Okay, 800 more. Yeah, you're taking 800. That's fine. This is, I mean, this is 1,700 a turn. That is not nothing. <laughs> it is currently more than I am dealing to you. So, uh... <laughs> yeah, I don't know what your set is, but I don't like it. So let's get rid of it. No! <laughs> Was that your out? 
No, it was just like a flip monster. <laughs> oh, wow. You have three, though. Dude, they have so many big monsters. Okay. Oh, let's look at your deck real quick. It was Ooh, a little greedy. Okay. It was a little greedy. Three giant soldiers. Okay. Sangan. Not, dude, this deck is insane. Oh, my God. Wait, why do you still get to home? look at it? Because I used Nobleman of Cross out and banished your flip effects. Your deck is nuts. Oh, they eroded the card to say each player reveals their main. Okay, that's stupid. You get to see my deck, too, after this. In GOAT um, format, so this wouldn't have happened. Archfiend's Roar. I need to read this. Pay 500 to the target Archfiend in the graveyard. Dude, they have so much support back in the day. This is crazy. Uh, yeah. <laughs> what Archfiend. is this? Huh? <laughs> you're thinking too, you're thinking of, of one that's similar to yours, and it's not at yeah, all. Yeah, <laughs> no, no, no. I know there's different... Uh, I, I did look at a couple of them. I know there's a few different ones, but I didn't want to spoil myself too much. Huh. Yeah. Okay. Interesting. Maybe you should have. You're kind of running low on monsters a little bit. What am I going to do after that? You have two big people. They're <laughs> burning you. I'm just going to set this. Yeah, it's fair. Yeah, let's just, let's just, I'm just going to keep the clock available. Okay. And so see this puts if you have a way what? to get rid of your own people. 32. Okay, that's not bad. Uh, yeah. Okay, let's take some Shadow Knight Archfiend. Yeah. I think. Summon um, another one. We'll go battle. Let's just see what this other face down is. Can't okay. be another Spirit Reaper. It can't be. Another Spirit Reaper. Oh, but it... Okay, fair. Yeah. It's the Sangan. All right. Uh, Let's grab... You know what? Why not? Let's just... <laughs> is this really at three? That's insane. Yeah. It's just wrong. It's just wrong. Oh, man. Um, I will... Set. Who would have thought that... I, I'm not... I'm not playing burn. You're not playing burn. <laughs> but it's a burn game. <laughs> okay, yeah, two. you know, I'm still not... Uh, I haven't given up. It's not over yet. I mean, there's, there's no, still time. No, no. This is all part of the plan, When really, you draw so. your next falling down, you can out it. Um, True, actually, yeah. You do have two more of those, I noticed. Uh, the thing is, like, your cards are all just... <laughs> it's like, I don't really want to get rid of them. Um, <laughs> let's try this guy. Um... This is not the most exciting game. This is Let's what Spirit this, Reaper yeah, turns into. If, if, you know, if you didn't have Spirit Reaper on the board, this would be a classic, you know, I would just be attacking. It'd be a good game all around. You had to come in here with monsters <laughs> that can't be destroyed by battle. That's absolutely just cheating. Um, would you really you set the other now. Spirit Reaper? Are you that kind of guy? I guess I don't have, uh, I don't have life to mess with anymore, so I'm just going to have to... I feel like it has to be... <laughs> Did you set? You didn't set a slate warrior. I know that. So what did you set? Is the question. Yeah, yeah. Just a little little trick for later. You added Spirit Reaper. I feel like you are so confident that this Spirit Reaper is going to stay on the board that you just didn't bother setting another Spirit Reaper. And also okay. I'm at fifteen hundred life points, so I am going to Lightning Vortex. Oh! oh this is a big gamble. Okay. That hey that that'll out the spirit reaper. Let's take it out. Um, and then we have that. Okay, let's. Uh, who, hmm. Oh wow, hmm. this is okay. scary. Flip summon archfiend soldier. Oh, big guy. Okay. Normal summon giant germ. This is a lot of damage. I'm trying over here. This is spirit oh, okay. reaper. Isn't it? I hate you so much. If it's spirit reaper. <laughs> What do you think it is? Final guess. I, I don't think it's Spirit Reaper. I don't think it's Spirit Reaper. You are correct. It is not Spirit Reaper. Ah, no, wait. That's but actually... it is my man-eater bug. That's pretty good, too, and, actually. Uh, hmm. The question is, if I get rid of your Ryu Koki, you're dying slower. Oh, that's a tough call. You know what? I'm going to get a little greedy. I'm going to pop this Archfiend Soldier. Soldier. Okay. I am kind of uh, dead to myself here, so I, I get it. I understand. I'm going to call the Haunted. I'm going Ooh. to Ryu Koki. Yes. I'm going to bring okay. him back. You could crash and do 500 damage. I would lose. Well, you know what? <laughs> I would not lose. I'd be at 100. You would not lose. You'd have 100 left. Um, no, I will crash here, I guess, because okay. that will save me a little bit. That you bit are going to out your guy. Damage. Yeah. Yeah. Strategically, I probably should have grabbed like a... Like a, something smaller, so you couldn't crash him. I don't know. I mean, Vampire Lord could have been a choice, I suppose. But I, I think that's a good play. I think it's fine. 
Yeah, it's probably fine. It's probably better that just in case you get through my next Spirit Reaper. I entered that battle phase thinking I was doing at least 3,000 damage, and here we are. <laughs> I did nothing. Um, I'm going to set one card. Yeah. I'll just pass to you. It's fine. I'm alive. I got, you know, 600. Okay. You are alive. This Archfiend guy has really, really taken its toll. Yeah, Do you're not tribute summon. wrong about that. Um, hit this. Probably the last rat or turtle or something. I think you have one turtle left. Ah, my old nemesis. <laughs> <laughs> Banging into a wall. Uh, this is... Go. go okay. Ahead. Go ahead. I, I'm just... I'm wondering if that last card is some sort of trick up your sleeve. Yeah, it's, it definitely is. It definitely is. You know, this would be really funny. <laughs> This would be kind of funny, but uh, I don't think I'm feeling I don't think I'm feeling that greedy. So I'm just gonna pass it. <laughs> Let's not do anything stupid here. All right, end phase. This will be. Oh, luckily, okay. I don't have to flip. I activate. So Book, Book of, of Moon, Moon doesn't out Spirit Reaper in Master Duel. Of course, no, it does it, not. It, it does not. I did this yesterday. Did but you can Book of Moon your own guy. Goat, I think. Yeah, I yeah, mean this is should, how I dodge. It should the, in original Goat, but it doesn't in Master Duel because I did this. Yeah. I think it was yesterday, and it just flipped him down. I was like, are you kidding me? Yeah, because the new errata, like, says after result. Yeah, no, it's tough. Yeah, it's kind of dumb. Um, okay. okay. so you are not dead. No, no, I did stay alive, which is the goal. Let's, uh, let's just pass to you. Let's just pass to you. Look, we're at turn 22. I did play a 50-something turn game yesterday because it was Spirit Reaper versus Spirit Reaper. Um, it wasn't that fun. I'm not going <laughs> to lie. <laughs> I, did, I don't know if I really prepared for Spirit Reaper. I'm going to be real with you, but uh, <laughs> we'll see what happens. The thing I am worried about is if you go Torrential could be bad. Mm. Um, that could out me. Um, and you have, well, you'd have to blow your own board up. I was about so to say, be, that'd be a pretty big torrential on my yeah, end. Yeah, look, okay. I, if you do that, you've got some serious Luster guts. Luster Dragon. Okay, so let's. What are we hitting here? That's the real question. That's the question. What are your sets? So you have a giant germ, which will bring out more giant germs. I think I'm just going to go for this, whatever What if this they're is. all giant germs? Well, one of them is not for you sure. You hit oh, my no! Sangin, my no! My ace monster. Um, That's not okay. good. Luckily, this does add <laughs> an out for no! Spirit Reaper to my hand. No! Okay, all right, at least we can see it coming, okay? At least we can yeah, see it coming. Yeah. It's turned into a real game. On um, turn 24, turn the 24. game really starts. What's really surprising is that it's turn 24, even though, like, my cards are blowing myself up. But <laughs> yeah. that's fine. Okay. Uh, yep, I mean, that's what I got. Go ahead. I wonder what that card is. Could be anything. Okay. Hey, you didn't set the Spirit Reaper, so this, I mean, this literally could be anything. It could be. Don't That's count fair. me out. Oh, interesting. Interesting card. All right. You still, look, if you want to, if you want to torrential all six cards, feel free. Oh gosh. Feel free. That's not bad. And we're going to, we're going to go through, we're going to, we're going to let you do your thing with this Spirit Reaper. All right. Let's just, let's just get rid of this guy. Okay. Yeah, so it, it, that's the end of our guy. Um, who was thinking about it? Luster Dragon. Yeah, I'm thinking over here. Give me a sec. Interesting. What's your other card then? Well, because I could pop the the luster that has not attacked. That's true. You could do that. <laughs> I gotta play to my outs. You know, I gotta play to my outs. I just gotta I gotta take a look at the grave. I gotta think about how did I go through all of those? That's kind of. Up. Yeah, yeah, we'll pop the Spirit Reaper. Okay, all right, there he goes. All right, well, I am going to actually take this thing out, if you yeah. allow me to. Nope, that's uh, fair. Your burn guy, let's just get rid of He is still big, you know. If you could win the game, I don't want that to happen. All right, still have that set. I'm going to set one more. All right, double luster dragon. Is that going to be enough, is the question. Um, well, unfortunately, the germs do have to summon an attack mode, which uh, does make this a little worse. But... <laughs> oh, you're allowed to activate this card? That's weird. Okay, huh. You learn something new every day. Um, Will we be learning? Yeah. MST. Okay. Chose not to use Going any end for the phase. Going new hoping, card. Yeah. Hopefully I don't get too punished for this. I was hoping maybe I would draw something different. Not have to worry about it. Mm, yeah, that's fine. Gacky break. It's a pretty Ooh. good hit. Okay. Uh, yep. Go ahead. 
All right, you. Ooh. I've already used Mirror Force. That's good. It's just been really hard to do damage to you with all the uh, <laughs> the floaters and the Spirit yeah. Reaper and the Man Eater Bug even. I'm trying to wall up. I'm finally gonna use this card. Oh my gosh! <laughs> why did you MST this? Because it's been set for 40 <laughs> turns. That's why I thought you might MST it. All right. No, that means it sucks. <laughs> <laughs> Frick. Okay, let's go to battle. Let's yeah. attack this thing. Let's see what kind of Sakuretsus you've got. Alright, you've got to have something. It would be nice. Um, you did do damage. I cannot. I'm not going to summon the germ. Okay, what in the world? If I summon a germ, yes. you just attack over it. Yeah, but what a set do you have? Do you have a set? You know, it's neither here nor there. Alright, well, we're going to find out. So tell me what you got back yeah, there. Yeah, I do have the call, call of the haunted. The haunted. Oh. Okay. What's your What's target here? Special Archfiend summon. Soldier, My crash. 1900 yes, vanilla. Con I'll continue that attack. Okay. 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 That's fair. Yeah, that's 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 a good play that keeps you alive. Uh, I'm gonna set a card. I I don't know. Let's about see what this you card. have now. Let's, let's see what I have. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, you have so many big guys. So many big guys. Smashing ground. No. Uh, go ahead. Oh, okay. <laughs> Playing around if your last set is... Uh, oh, wait. All three Spirit Reapers are engraved. Okay, whatever. You can revive it, yeah. <laughs> hypothetically. This Book of well, Life. Well, here we go. Yeah, Book of Life exists. Let's just see what, what you got down there. Wall of Illusion. You're not allowed to use fiends. Those are only mine. Attack yeah, directly. Yeah, you got it. You got it. Oh, oh, how many turns was that? 29. We didn't make it to 30. 29 okay. turns, but the Spirit Reaper is too strong. Spirit Reaper just walled up. Okay, that's just, that's the, that's game one. We're just feeling out the decks. Let's get to game two. Let's see what you can do. I'm assuming you would like to go first this time as well. Yeah. Yeah, I'll go first. I think this is a really tough matchup for me. I don't know if there is a worse matchup than Floaters. So I figured out yesterday that anything against Spirit Reaper <laughs> feels like a bad matchup. Yeah, yeah no, it's just brutal. It's like you always have to have removal ready or something that targets it. Well, okay. it's just I've seen your annoying. entire deck. What was your gimmick? Okay, I will tell it to you because it's, I have an annoying deck. Starter and structure decks from Go Format. So I have all kinds of random stuff, and they have the zombie deck, which has like ah, Spirit Reaper, okay. Ryu Koki, like all those good cards. That seems like then, overpowered. I'm gonna be honest, compared to some of those I, other spins. <laughs> well, when I first did it, I was like, this this is gonna suck. There's, there's nothing that good. And then when we spun it, we went in. I'm like. You know what? These cards are pretty good. Yeah, you don't that's get crap. a few big stables like I'll tell you. I don't have Mirror Force, um, so there's some cards that you don't get that are pretty nice. But the monsters are pretty strong. That's what I got. Could be a Spirit Reaper of my own. Maybe I change my deck up after uh, the duel. Oh, this is interesting. Okay, let's just um, let's just do this. Pamir Turtle. Let's figure out what you got set. Oh, well, this is funny. This is very funny. Oh. Yep. Oh. oh, giant germ! Yeah. <laughs> it's, a it's a terrible trade. <laughs> <laughs> the turtle's better, actually. <laughs> yeah, that's kind of sad. Um, okay. Wow, what a what... great trade for me. That actually went better than expected. That's brutal. I, got, I was like, surely it'll be something. I should have thought that you have giant germs. Yeah, I always, you know, keeping those germs in the back pocket. We will normal summon Archfiend Soldier. Golly, you got a lot of damage on the board already. Okay, let's go. I mean, if... You have, I mean, you could have sack. I guess I didn't see. I should have taken, I should have taken notes. I should have written down your entire deck list. I mean, <laughs> no man. Okay. This is, yeah, I mean, this is that. what the deck is supposed to do a little bit when there's nothing blocking yeah, the attacks. Yeah, this is scary. This is a problem. Okay. Okay. I was thinking that face down. It seems you got something chainable. I'm not sure <laughs> what it is. Maybe this will draw it out. Well, you'll find out eventually. Okay. Not even that. Wow. Really holding on. Um... Ouch. Hmm. Go ahead. Okay, oh, it's probably Jar Greed this. again. I, <laughs> it's probably <laughs> Jar Greed. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is bad, bad, bad. Oh, That's all man. I gotta say. <laughs> all right, there we'll he see is. What you got. The Spirit let's Reaper just, himself. Let's just get set up here. Let's <laughs> set everything. Okay, I don't think was Morphing Jar in a structure deck. I don't actually think so at this point. Let's try to dig for something cool. Okay. Deck out. It's going to be deck out. This is a good game. Been. I had to <laughs> save it before I resolved the germs because I didn't want to draw them. Smart, um, smart. We'll, we'll do this. We'll do this. A little we'll defensive, huh? Bit. Yeah. Okay. Luckily, Pyramid Turtle doesn't run over any of the recruiters. So, okay, it is the Spirit Reaper, yeah. <laughs> He's back for more. 
<laughs> um, okay, well, let's set. And... Go what? Okay. <laughs> I hope okay. all those back rows are just jar greeds. Just <laughs> jar, 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 jar. Jar, jar. Oh, man. Okay, I, I need to figure out... Okay, let's, let's see. What do you got for this? Ooh, okay. Let's see what you got for this. Crashing the turtles. That's actually like a pretty big play. That's fine. That's sure. Crash them. No, let's go for the crash. See Double if I crash. Can. Summon two monsters from deck? No problem. All right, then. Let's see if this works out. We'll start off with a uh, shiny Ryu Koki. Yep. Beautiful. And then we'll vampire lord it up. Oh, yeah. Let's vamp it up. Okay, we'll keep going to battle. Let's try to vampire this guy. Now, Vampire Lord is a pretty good option here because it will oh! revive itself from this mirror force. That is true, but I still lose the uh, I still lose the Ryu Koki, the mirror force, putting in some work there. I mean, I'd say it's doing something because the uh, the Vampire yeah. Lord only comes back during your standby phase, so I am safe for a second. That's unfortunate. Okay, okay, let's just end here. You've got a large board, and I'm not a fan of it. I'm trying out here. I really am. Okay, let's uh, let's graceful. You've had it. Now it's oh, my turn. Oh, he's digging for more. Uh oh. Discard. Yeah, get rid of that guy. He's dangerous. Just looking at the grave. Um, do I really need this? I, I don't really know. Hmm. Yeah, we'll discard the other one too. <laughs> okay. Understandable. We'll flip knight assailant. Oh. I do happen to have it. That is not good at all. What structure deck was um, Man Eater Bug in? Uh, I think it was Yugi or, no, not structure, starter oh, deck for that one. Yeah. Oh my God, that's so, so was good. Bug, yeah. So the starter decks mostly were terrible, but then they had like a couple cards like Man Eater. A couple staple nice. cards, yeah. Yeah, that, that worked out pretty good. Um, I need to think about this. I think to play it safe, I need to make sure you don't kill me this turn. So let's do that. Oh, yeah, you, we were talking about my torrentials. Let's talk about yeah. your torrential here. That's pretty damn good. Yeah, let's let's get let's get that out of here. You still have a summon, but I still have a summon. All right. If you played around it, I didn't want you to have four monsters. I out of banish three germs to summon oh, dark necrofear. The, <laughs> the necrofear. Oh, okay, what is its actual effect again? Target one face up monster, equip that card. Is, oh, it's like a relinquished. Oh, man. Little bit, little bit. Oh, Getting used out of, of some royal rare I pulled two years ago. It looks awesome, though. I'll give it to you. you get, hey, look, you're welcome. I'll let you use that thing. It's going through. It's No, oh, I actually was man. pretty excited when I saw the, the fiend roll because of that. Um, yeah, that's awesome. We will set. We will... Hey, he's bigger than Vampire Lord. Yeah, fourteen hundred. I mean, what more could I possibly? I guess I could set this one. Yeah, yeah. Go ahead. Setting a lot of cards, huh? Hey, just matching you, my buddy. A lot of cards. I'm very low on life right now. I'm not feeling too good. <laughs> I've been there. I know. That's not bad. Okay, Vampire Lord, return. Coming back. Honestly, a pretty good card in general. Just kind of got power crept as soon as uh, Cyber Dragon got released. But yeah, I mean, just having that, it's kind of annoying to out. Like you have to attack over it most of the time or banish yeah. it or something. But especially back then, um, man, you got two back row. You've used your mirror force. That's good. You know, the mirror force is in the graveyard. Just to double check. I did use it on the, the vampire lord. Yeah, I'm going to do this. Let's book of life. Let's bring back my Ryu Koki. I'll banish your Night Assailant just in case you had any weird flip stuff going on. Yes. Yes. Okay. The question is, are you playing that mirror wall? Because I could be in big trouble if you were playing. <laughs> you have you me down that? to 1,200. I would take 1,000 damage. That'd be brutal. So put you at 400, and then the Dark Necrofear would only hit for 200, so... I wish you were... I wish you rolled a, a Spellcaster or a Warrior deck. That'd make Ryu Koki a little better. I wouldn't have to worry about it. Uh, <laughs> that would actually be quite funny, yeah. Just having an unbeatable <laughs> be insane. monster. Yeah. Oh, man. I, I, uh, you have Archfiend's Roar, too, which could just win the game. You haven't played that yet. Attacking is just, like, super dangerous here. <laughs> That's fair. Um, but That's you fair. also can suck me up with your card. That's the problem. If I just <laughs> sit here, 
Dark Necrofear goes hard, I'm gonna be honest. My ace monster. Oh man, I think, I hate to do this, but I think to be safe. Ooh, okay. We're gonna, we're gonna pitch Call of the Haunted, which feels super bad. Get rid of this Dark Necrofear. Yeah. Just to play around potentially mirror wall and all that stuff. No, I, I think that's definitely the right call. Yep. Cause like I could lose if you Archfiend's Roar. Um, and we'll just try to do a bunch of damage and see if that'll do something. Mm -hmm. Uh and we do get to send one of your cards. True. Well, you got you got rid of your Necrofear. Let's get rid of let's get rid of your trap cards. Those things are kind of scary. Yeah, I think that with the errata, a little harder yeah. to use that yeah. ring. That thing's dead, yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, all right, all right. Not feeling great about this one. Give me. That is unfortunate. No, I mean, honestly, yeah, Dark Necrofear, <laughs> not kind even that bad, truly. Kind of insane. Um, okay, that is a card in the deck. Uh, Yeah, let's go battle. Hit you for 24. Mm. How many times have I stolen your Ryu Kokis? Is it Jar of Greed or is it Rush Recklessly? Oh, sh okay. And my 700 attack. Defeat I would my never own monster. have expected that in a million years, I'm going to be honest. But, uh, <laughs> okay, okay. Well, you, bad, were, uh, you didn't expect it. That's good. My yep. one card versus your six. Is it powerful Dude, enough? Archfiend's Roar. I activate a different oh! Archfiend's Roar. Oh, no. Oh no. Oh, it's coming. Don't oh, you worry. No. Don't do it. I pay all no, of my I life. That's right. Points. It was Bark of Dark Roar. That's I was calling it Archfiend's Roar. That's what I meant. That there's guy. barking oh. and there's calling. 100 life points, oh. by the way. <laughs> <laughs> that, that's kind of insane. I'm not going to lie. That's kind dude. of an insane Holy. card. Okay. Okay. Yo, look. Spear Reaper. Not that good when you got. The Bark of Dark Ruler, okay. Yeah, if I can get going, you know, I think my deck has some... Maybe it was just that I didn't summon any Archfiend card that pays life points. Maybe that was yeah. the... Uh... <laughs> it also helps when I do the worst creature swap of all time. That's <laughs> Oh, yeah, I outplayed you pretty hard with that. Maybe I should have played creature yeah. swap. I didn't even consider that. I'm scared to use creature swap now. I thought I was doing a big brain play. I was doing a small brain play. Okay. No, no. I will go first, please. Yeah. In game three... Let's try to... Man, this is interesting. You finally get to start. That must feel good. Yeah, that's nice. Nice to draw a card. Okay. Let's just start off with a very simple set. Wow. <laughs> you have so many good set cards. Um, I am a, a very strong setter. Let's just see what you have. Okay. Molt attack the over Sangin. the... Oh, no. <laughs> this Take a thousand. guy. This a giant soldier guy. of stone. Okay, Sangin is. Yeah, he's, he's here. He's pretty decent. Yeah, he's just chilling. Got him as my pet. Got him as my card. This is my monster right here. It's my boy. Yeah, I'm just going to relax a little bit. Yeah, he's over there chilling. He's just with his three eyeballs on the side of the duel watching himself play. Um,. Yeah, I'm, I'm relaxing. I'm good. I don't the need you to do 5K again like you did that one time. Spirit Reaper. It's happening. Okay. Um, Is it Spirit Reaper time? Would you like to attack with Sangin? Yeah. Always. Okay, <laughs> okay that's a little annoying. <laughs> He's just taking damage. <sighs> yeah, yeah. There's that right, one Send him back. He it's didn't summon though, so terrible. it's not going to change too much. Welp. Go ahead. All right. You are setting cards. Could be a giant germ. Could be a nice It could. I mean, I can take a guess at what it might be, but uh, let's see what you think it is. Um, you have not torrentialed me yet, but I'm assuming you are playing it, so I need to consider that. All right. Well, I'm, I'm gonna risk it. A I'm gonna risk it. Let's okay. try my Ryu Koki, which yeah. I apparently draw every opening hand. <laughs> okay. Let's see playing? about this nine I mean, at least two. I play two, okay. and I draw them every time. It was the germ. You were correct. Okay, it was germ. I did not creature swap this time, so I'm feeling good about that. Summon, feeling summon. Good. Okay, a lot of burn damage there. I'm not a fan of that. Um, we will. I set think there's some changes card. I would have made to my deck. Not, <laughs> not like putting in more spirit reaper outs, but I think that there's a <laughs> one area that I sometimes screw up in these old school formats that I probably should have considered. But it's fine. It's good. We're we're chilling. Normal summon Archfiend Soldier. Oh no, <laughs> what are you doing? I think you know, we're taking that Ryu Koki. No, I can't let you no. control it for more than one turn. No, 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 no. 
It's not good. Yeah. Well, let's see if you got the mirror force or not. Oh, you don't have mirror. Oh, I'm so stupid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I do not have mirror force. Keep forgetting. I'm playing around a card um, that doesn't exist. This is playing around wings, windstorm of Antiqua or whatever. You played that in one yeah. of your decks. I did, I did. I do like Windstorm of Etiquette. It's a nice card. Yeah. That's, I don't think, is in a structure deck either. So Probably just not. FYI. I think it was a uh, video game promo, if I remember correctly. Yeah, it was originally a video game promo. Do I like my giant soldier? You know what? I do like my giant soldier. Let's. Curse this is a very similar to Windstorm, Nubis. but it will not switch your Archfiend because he's a vanilla monster. Oh, interesting. Oh, over oh, the rest of the turn, their positions can't be changed. I was like, yeah. forever? <laughs> no, no, no. That'd be insane. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I did. <laughs> I played around it. The germs have a hundred defense instead of zero. Um, it's genius. Outplayed, out maneuvered. Go ahead. Okay. All right. You've got a burn card on the field. I'm okay with that. Yeah. The question is, can I survive that long? Um, I just don't like when you keep stealing my monsters. I am not a fan of it. Not so strong without your spirit reaper. Are you there? Ruxin? No, I'm not actually. I'm really not. Let's start off by summoning my giant rat in attack position. Oh wow, we haven't seen this guy in a minute. Okay, let's uh, let's let's take my guy back. Can I please have that? Okay, dude. Yeah, let's chill for a sec. So now, <laughs> so now every turn, you're gonna take I, burn. <laughs> I gain a thousand during my standby. You lose, er, and then I lose eight hundred during your standby. Perfect. It's like counteracting a little bit. Okay, yeah, let's let's try to take out. Let's see if that's if you don't destroy me right here with a bark of dark ruler. No, that's pretty good. But I do have a mirror, mirror wall. wall. Okay, just get all those cards off the field. Yeah, about to say now no one everything. owns it. Let's just you know it, it got to we had a love triangle going on with Ryu Koki, <laughs> and uh, you know it just blew up in its face. So I love happens. when you have fifty things connected to one card and there's all those like lines attached to it when you click yeah. it and then they blow up and just everything leaves. Well, I can still destroy this giant germ. I'm going to do that. And uh, feel free to pay for mirror, for mirror mirror wall if you want to do more damage. Okay, let's set a card. All right, we're into a weird spot here. Let's see, 5350. Oh, that's funny that that blocks that. Um, Are you paying 2K? Mm, Got plenty of life points. No, I think <laughs> I've learned that life points are a resource that i should conserve <laughs> yeah, they, can, they can matter occasionally so this is only it only gets to the pyramid turtles which is like fine i guess i mean i, I gotta do damage somehow sure you can attack my rat i mean i guess it can get to the giant soldier of stone so i don't want to you know you can also do that that's true i would be glad to bring out my pyramid because you can like summon the soldier switch it to defense kind of turtle up if you need to yeah he's just kind of an extra option if we need to defense up Got a lot of cards well, up there. I'm sure yeah, something you yeah, can set. Yeah, there are. <laughs> set and go. Okay, you've got that Archfiend. He's pretty large. Yeah, I'm trying, I'm trying. Oh, okay, that's a nice timing for that. Let's just get rid of whatever that is right there. That that's Slate fair. Warrior you set. No, Sangin. Or Sang oh, okay, I think I'm back. done that's, setting okay. Slate Warriors. I think that happened to me one time, and that was too many. I thought it would be risky. I almost only put two in my deck for that reason, but... Yeah, I that's, that's reasonable. Okay, let's do... How aggressive do you, I want to get? And the answer is not that aggressive. Let's just do this. Ooh, okay. Not willing to get aggressive when I have no back row. Yeah, we're not going to get too aggressive. I mean, we're going to get a little aggressive, but we're not yeah. going to get too aggressive. Get a little wacky, so we're gonna get bring a little out, funky. We're going to get out this guy. Mm -hmm. He's going to do a little cleanup for us. Yeah. And we will get rid of that. Still got your germ. Okay, I'm going to set one more. Okay, Ryu Koki. He's chill. Okay, well, let's draw. Perfect, just what I wanted. Um, I can take a guess at what the face down is. <laughs> uh, I mean, you have one in hand. Yeah, sure. I'll smashing ground. I don't really want ah, to. Ah, smashing ground. That's a good card. Luckily, I get to choose. You know. Yeah. Yeah, I wanted to yeah. smashing the uh, the giant rat, but the <laughs> the giant soldier of stone was blocking it. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> He's too big. A giant warrior made of stone. I do okay. need to figure out what this face down is, just so I have sure, some more feel free. knowledge. Okay, that's fine. 
Pyramid Turtel. Two Ryukokis engraved though, so you're only going for Vampire Lord, which is still good, but not um, yeah, still decent. Not as scary, I guess, to some degree. Oh, a lot Go of ahead. back row, huh? I got a germ and a dream. A lot of back row. Okay. Interesting. Oh, I gotta say, you know, I always gotta bring this up whenever I see it. I for the and I curi I'm curious what you thought too. When I was a kid, and I didn't own it because it was kind of expensive and it was in like a tournament pack. I always thought giant germ was like on a petri dish. I did not notice <laughs> that it's like a giant germ attacking a mountaintop. Did you did you realize that always or? I I'm trying to remember. I do remember thinking that it looked like that. Yeah. I don't remember what I if I actually thought it looked like that because you know you start just co-mingling so many thoughts but right i do remember thinking like this just looks like a big like circle dish that you like just laying out you know so and, like especially that, in the old game boy games when there was like it was the resolution was so low like i just couldn't tell yeah yeah there was like uh in 144p uh, you know like three bits putting it together um oh man this is i'm a little bit scared of all your uh all your back row this but is the closest one something. by far this has been uh it's scary on my end too, trust me. Yes, all right, then we're gonna try this. We're gonna pay a few life points. I'm gonna bring out my guy, Ryukuki. All right, let's try to do a little damage. At least if you lower me to zero, you only have a thousand, so it's not gonna hurt as bad. True. What will you do? Mirror wall is gone. Even if you did it, I would still attack over. I'm gonna bark. Okay, the bark. And life points. we are only going to pay a little bit less this time. We're gonna pay 15. Put it to nine. Okay. Take it out. Okay. Well, I'm going to get a little aggressive here. Okay. Uh, Let's try to bring him back. Wow. So if I didn't do that, I might have just been dead. Well, no, I, I would have been low. Yeah. I think you'd be alive. Yeah. Let's see what you got here. Okay. Nothing there. Nothing there. You take five. Okay, I'm taking. Yeah, man, we're both losing life points every turn. Yeah, tell me about it. <laughs> okay, all right, let's see what you got. Oh man, this one is a barn burner. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Top deck. Oh, okay. I mean, if I was gonna oh. get a top deck, I think the pot of greed is a pretty good one. Oh yeah. Where's that graceful? Um. Oh, not graceful, but <sighs> interesting. That changes everything. Um. Uh oh. Yeah. Interesting. Interesting. That really does change everything. Um, let's go. Yeah, let's banish germ, germ, germ. You know the drill. No. Dark Necrofear hits the board no! once again. That's not good. And then I will crash. Oh, that's not good. Go main two. Dark Necrofear. Set. We'll go end phase. Let's take oh, no. that Ryukoki. How many Ryukoki times? Ryukoki is I my worst enemy. He just keeps card. ending up on your side of the field. I know. It's like I don't have any <laughs> big monsters. I gotta take yours. Oh man. Well you do. They're just not quite big enough. They're yeah. all big, just not quite big enough. You know, I almost played uh Mystic Plasma Zone, but I decided not to because oh, I was yeah. like, you might play some dark monsters. Very glad I didn't, because then the Ryukoki would be at 29. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he'd be huge. Like, Fortunately no for me, I just top deck this. Um, okay, I can't. I literally can't complain. That's fine. I'm in no oh, position to complain. Okay. Um. Look, Vampire Lord, I love you. I think you gotta go. Oh. Okay. Let's do. I think that needs to go. Wow, you are really low on monsters. Then interesting. This is a pretty nice card in this situation. Uh, I I think I lose. When Necrofear, I have, it's attached to Call of the Haunted and Necrofear. If I destroy Call of the Haunted, what would happen? Would it still stake as a Necrofear? Like if I was, in theory, wasn't destroying both? Or, sorry, which one are you asking? If you popped Necrofear, it would go back to you. If you popped Call, it would just destroy. It would destroy? Okay, yeah, that's what I thought. Okay. We'll try to chain this, at least. Okay. I don't think you should have a normal summon that can get over this guy. I'm not happy about this, but. Okay, all right, Heavy Storm, good draw. Oh, this is Fortunately really for me, I made the, the right choice of cards to keep, which was Luster Dragon. Ah, okay, okay, that's yes, fair. That's so fair. Like, just in case you got like a, a Karibo or something, he's a fiend, isn't he? He <laughs> is a fiend, yeah, up, yeah. Oh, to attack. Man. 
Giant soldier, he sat on the field the whole game. I had the premature burial in hand, so I would have gone down to 50 oh. life points. Oh, that would have been bad, too. Okay. Wow, okay, that one was intense. No Spirit Reapers in that one. That no was Spirit good. I, see how much more fun the game is without Spirit Reaper? I agree, I do agree. Okay, it's two to one. It's two to one. This could be an elimination game here. Look, I just need my giant soldier to be in defense mode. Okay, you're going second, so I will go first. Yes, let's open a good hand. Let's see. Okay. <laughs> yeah, oh, it's like man. as I draw these hands, I see the critical error. But maybe it's just because <laughs> I've seen your deck. Yeah, my, my deck is my deck is pretty solid. It's pretty solid overall. Okay. Um. You know what? I don't even feel like doing what anything. What are you doing? <laughs> is this like a flex or something? No, I don't think that's a flex. I think that's a. Uh, Weird hand moment. Okay, well, I feel okay about normal summoning this. Okay, thank God. I was like, if you open Spirit Reaper, mega punished, but I'm yeah, sure Yeah, that, that would be pretty bad. If I had opened Spirit Reaper, I definitely would have done it. Um, yeah. Unfortunately, I didn't, but I'm okay with just passing the Sangin on the field. No back row either. Well, check out this OTK I'm about to do in <laughs> GOAT not. format. Um, you kind no. of almost did that in game two. But you did fall right oh, into crash. my trap because now I can crash number. my germ. Oh no, and I want to take damage. Yep. I will get to search. That's good. Not you saying. know what? I could search. Arguably, the search is better than the damage and the double special here. <laughs> but <laughs> I could search my spirit right. reaper. True. It's you know what else monster. I could search is I could search my pyramid turtle, and I think right. I'm going to do that. Pyramid turtle could be anything, even spirit reaper. It could also be a spirit reaper, unless you have your nobleman of cross out. Germ it up. Yeah, I am going to take damage. I'm already down to 55. I don't like this. It's, it's, it's good. I mean, the germs add up. I'm not going to lie. They're doing some um, damage to me. Yeah, that's fine. Setting cards. Okay. One back row. We finally got there. I mean, it might look good that I'm passing with five cards in hand, but, you know, you got to put yourself <laughs> in my shoes. Like, what cards could those be? The, you know, the falling down. I have can't a be strong activated, feeling like, you have a nobleman of cross out in hand. A strong feeling. You have a back row. Okay, I think summoning this, if we do get destroyed by battle... You know, it's not the worst because we can summon into something. So let's go for that. Okay, we're doing damage. You're gonna you're gonna damage me. Man, these yep. things do they do really stack up. I mean 1500 damage is not nothing, especially if they get to direct attack. Yeah, 1500 plus uh, you know, the two thousand from the that's a lot. Yeah, I'm gonna set a card. Okay. Okay, five K. Not feeling great about that. Our pyramid turtle though, he's gonna wall up. Um, okay, that's interesting. I'm so afraid to. <laughs> oh, he's back. He's back for more. He's back for more. Oh, the question is, what do I go into? Do I go into a spirit reaper? I'll take damage. You might have an out. Do I go into Ryu Koki for next turn? Your germ is going to be able to attack. You have potential Archfiend's Roar. Or whatever, that, not Archfiend's Roar, uh, Roar of Dark Ruler, whatever that stupid thing's bark. called. Bark. It bark, uh, you know. Bark one, of Dark One's ruler. a bark, one's a doing. roar. <laughs> he's not roaring, he's barking. Um, yeah. He's barking up the wrong tree that on this one. Dark Ruler has um, a dog in him. You know how he gets. He got that dog in him. Um, let's do a... I'm going to bring out the Ryu Koki. I don't feel incredible about it, but I'm going to bring him out. Okay. Um, yep. He's that big. He's, he's scary. Yeah, that's pretty good, actually. Okay. My life points are teetering a little bit. Go ahead. You got new back row. Okay. I mean, honestly, the Shadow Knight Archfiend by itself isn't a lot of. I mean, it is a lot of damage, but it was taking the <laughs> seventeen hundred. Yeah, yeah. So the double, really the double whammy made it like a four or five turn clock. Yeah. Oh man. Um. I, I, I just know you're going to have Bark of Dark Ruler. But somehow I've this never guy. known what that card did. That card's insane. It's a Battle Pack 3 card, so I am very familiar. But... I kind of love this Fiend deck, which is all these snatch steals and stuff no, like I, that. No, I thought it's... it was kind of a... Of all the types to get, I think this one um, really provided some interesting deck building options. So I had a lot yeah, of fun. Yeah, it actually that. like has real cards that go with Fiends, which is really cool. Right, yeah. Most of the other types <sighs> don't have a ton of those. Uh, okay, all right. We got, we're going to get a little aggressive. I'm a little scared. Here, the least punishing is to attack this germ, because if I go to zero, I just take 100. So I'm going to attack True. this. I am actually going to Ring of Destruction. Oh, oh that's so bad. <laughs> I forgot you had that. That's not good. And hey, I got, you know, if I get it off when we have life points, the errata doesn't matter, right? So 
that is really I'm still scared of Nobleman of Cross out too. Probably. Yeah. Because because of that, I'm gonna do this. Oh. Okay. I'm gonna do I'm actually gonna bring this back. For the turtle. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna bring the turtle back. Could always go into a spirit reaper to block damage. Yeah, I like it. Yeah, we're gonna wall up a little bit. If you do have that nobleman, then I'm not as vulnerable. Okay, here we go. Okay, what do we got? Um, Man, that ring did so much damage. Okay. Okay, 35. You got four turns left of that guy. True. I won't need that many. Oh, I guess you don't have to worry about the four turns anymore. Cool. <laughs> nice. Send him back. Go ahead. Okay, germ is going <laughs> to put germ me damage, at uh, look a it's little actually scary. A lot. It's actually a lot. Um, all right, let's get rid of this guy. Mm. He's that with defense. sack. Sack a red suit. Oh, that's See you brutal. later, Pyramid Turtle. Oh, where is that effect? That... Oh, wait. Oh, it's brutal. I just didn't want you to do 500 damage to yourself. I was trying to yeah, say that's, that. Yeah, that's fair. Oh, my gosh. So many back row cards. Face okay. down cards, I should say. Not. Okay. You going to bring mm. that guy out that burns himself again? <laughs> I was thinking about it, yeah. That'd be fine. I mean, I wouldn't be too mad. Even that rat. wasn't the Spirit Reaper. Holy <laughs> shit. The Spirit Reaper is waiting in the wings. Yeah, that's actually like kind of <laughs> nuts. Um, okay, that's actually not how I wanted that to go. I'm going to be honest. Um, yeah. Okay. Okay. Now I'm getting worried. Gonna that I was really hoping that was going to be a Spirit Reaper. <laughs> Okay, Spirit Reaper is chilling. You never thought you'd say that. Do you have Mirror Force? Do you have Bark? I know you have a Bark. You've got the Bark. And it's going to take a thousand damage from here. I'm going to Mirror Force it. Tack of it. Okay, Mirror Force. We're just losing people left and right. I don't want that special summoning anything. Oh my god. This, yeah, I understand. This one's okay, a go Spirit ahead. Reaper. <laughs> one of them has to be. Mm, okay. One of them has to be the Spirit Reaper. Let's check it out. I'm taking a lot of chip damage. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's... I, I don't know what I'm supposed to do against that. Giant Germ is just living forever. Actually, yeah. We're going to need some uh, We're gonna need some hand sanitizer for this one because this dude is hanging around. All right. Okay, okay. Give me something big here. Give me I something I can't believe big. you haven't drawn a Spirit Reaper. Or you're just you're, you're mind gaming me. Your hand is both Spirit Reapers. <laughs> Yeah, okay, that. you've used Mirror Force, Sakuretsu Armor, Ring of Destruction. Th this thing is going to kill this thing eventually. <laughs> or will it? That's fine. Okay, 200. I'm going to take five. I'm at 17. Okay, I can get that off my conscience. Thinking about that thing. Okay, yeah. main two. Let's set one more. Okay. All right. Um, I mean, that's fine like i guess uh here we go he's back <laughs> oh my god his face down is is he back <laughs> oh my god every time <laughs> every time he's like, back for a brief well. period um okay that actually does make things a little bit worse for me <sighs> yikes that puts me in a weird spot puts me in a really weird spot well this feels bad uh <laughs> oh <laughs> Oh, oh, the bark! You must have one set. You have one set. There's no way you don't. Um, if you have to pay for it, though. So if I can get you low enough. 2450. I'm sure it's fine. I'm sure it's fine. I'm sure it's fine. Ryu Koki doesn't kill you, so you're good. Yeah, no, that's <laughs> that's exactly where I'm looking. Like, <laughs> Oh, great. Okay. How do um, I keep getting to 50? I, I don't even know. Oh, the, it's just the wall. Of course. Yes. Yeah. Um. Okay, here we go. Luster Dragon. Let's see how much damage we can do. You letting that happen or no? Oh, wow. Okay, Bark is turned off, essentially, unless it's a 500 difference. Say, I can pay 500. Don't count me out. Yeah, you get it, it, which will, in a lot of cases, actually matter. But yeah. Yeah. it at least can't make me lose, like, 1,700. There so that's is good a, to know. a Bark card released later called Prideful Roar that, like, works on anything and also gives you, like, a I think a 300 attack boost when you activate it. So that one's actually, like, pretty strong and sealed okay well uh let, thankfully that was released later so i don't have to worry about yeah no stuff. you're good you're good imagine <laughs> that would be scary oh okay. right on time hell yeah no, um okay no, anyway no, no, let's no, no, uh let's heavy no 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 what are we taking out here Ooh. okay that's not good 
let's normal. And oh, I am sorry, but we are going to the fifth and no! final game. I am taking your luster down. dragon. I am hitting you with it oh. for lethal. Where's your Karibo <laughs> now? You destroyed my trap hole. Ah, oh, what you have set, by the way? Um, Bark. Yeah, it was Bark the whole time. Okay, it was Bark. Okay. <laughs> Dang it. All right, we're going to game five. That was another good one. Okay. Oh, wow. All right, final game. This is... I was holding on to like to be a good three match. outs for the Spirit Reaper for the whole time. Like the Vortex, the Ring, and the Snatch Deal. I literally I like, had like six monsters in hand. I just I was covered in monsters. I'm learning. It only took me five games, but I'm learning GOAT format live on camera. I mean, you're, you're doing pretty good. You're okay. Interesting. Oh, yes. I would love I would love to go first. Incredible. Just don't accidentally attack, you know, just don't accidentally attack. I would love to do that. That would get a little extra damage in. Huh? Let's see. Let's just settle down real quick. That's all you're doing. You don't have no play that normal summons a monster on turn <laughs> one. <sighs> hey, it's goat format. <laughs> yeah, true. Okay, cool. That's great. Um. Oh, okay. Go right, ahead. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> what? What? What's? What's that? Making fun of my set? What's your play <laughs> setting? <laughs> you had twice as many sets as I did. I'm not laughing anymore. <laughs> That's fair. That's fair. Yeah, I couldn't use my nobleman the whole game because you wouldn't set anything. True. Okay, your set. Your sets are giant germ. Please don't be giant germ again. Giant germ. Golly. <laughs> That's like the only thing you said. Night assailant, I guess. Sangin. And. Uh, Slate, Slate Warrior, Warrior. If you get aggressive. <laughs> yeah. yeah, if you're going to do that. Uh, okay, let's figure it out. Okay. None of those are going to punish me with defense too much, so... Yeah, no, you're good. It is the germ. He's always the germ. available. Leave let's get back. this damage out of the way quickly, okay? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Oh, only one! <laughs> Interesting! <laughs> don't, don't think... Oh, I just wanted to summon one. That was a strategical move on my part. It was an part. artistic a choice. Decision. Okay, yeah, you just like the look of one, one giant germ on the field? Yeah. Okay. That's fair. That's fair. All right. The germs are back. I feel like I can't get them out of my life. It just feels so bad. Like, what am I supposed to do? I'll summon another giant germ. There, there he is. Okay. Yeah. That's fair. Would you like to crash? Um, let's see what this one is first. And then okay. I'll tell you. Okay, that's just demoralizing. I'm going to be real <laughs> with you. That's like... <laughs> you want to crash? Yeah, I have to. I got to get rid of it eventually. My Sangin goes to the grave. Okay. It's like if I don't crash, damage. you just normal summon luster dragon like <laughs> okay let's grab my uh, pyramid turtle okay deal 500 don't forget about that yeah I'm, um, I'm i think it probably cost me last game actually i might have survived without that true it adds up that's what it's all it about. definitely adds up okay those germs add up you know then you get sick I still, you have still not played Torrential, so I'm not even sure if you're playing it or not, which is Surely it's in the deck. I just haven't drawn Surely. it. Or I forgot to put it in there. Well, one of the two. Um, okay, look, you have Mirror Force. You've, I've hit it every time, but this I mean, I'm going to play around it Ooh. very carefully. You probably have something for this, but if you don't, it will hurt a little bit. I got a little something, I guess. Okay, all right. At least it's not 2,400 this game. Right, right. No, it's, you know, um, just a that's little... fine. I'm trying to keep it fair. I am trying to only keep monsters on the field that can be destroyed by battle because I play, you know, with honor and integrity. <laughs> yeah, okay. Respectable, respectable. Oh, okay. Nothing with the wall. That's fair. Wall of Illusion. You got your Archfiend guy ready to take it out, bounce mm -hmm, back. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Did you just in phase? I sure did. What in the world is happening? I should have saved Spirit Reaper. <laughs> okay. Um, well, in that case, I I'm waiting for your Karibo. What are you? What in you have a giant germ. What are you doing? With what is summoning? Please tell me what summoning giant germ does in this position. You could set him. That seems pretty bad. That seems like it gives you a creature swap target. That's fair, because I at least know you have gotten rid of him. Okay. Yeah, yeah that that's cool. That's cool. I'll I guess I'll take the damage for now. Um... Yeah, okay, go ahead. All right, let's lightning vortex. Yeah, okay, yeah, there it is. All right, yeah, okay, that's fine. We'll get rid of bark. I think I'm running out bark, of life points yeah. faster than you are, so <laughs> that probably yeah, doesn't work. Possible, yeah, possible. And now, with full There's power, the giant germ, the germ, in germ is back. <laughs> it just can't get rid of these things. They yeah. just never go away. Ooh, okay, I'm getting there. We're getting close. One more germ attack, and we're at the same <laughs> life. <laughs> uh, okay, it's set. 
Go ahead. <sighs> More cards. Okay. I'm pretty Lightning sure I'm only going to summon Giant Germ this game, by the way. Like, that's my plan. That's what it seems like. Pretty much Germ every game, turbo. that's what it seems like. Yeah, actually. Interesting. Let's just set a car. Let's settle down a little bit. Let's try to <laughs> try to calm down before this giant germ gets All too crazy. All you can do is settle down. Okay, <laughs> I sure, love to settle down. Sure. Relax. Let's knock it. No! Did we hit a spirit reaper? Did we take it out? Ball. Really, anything's a good hit. Yeah, even that's yeah. fine. I mean, that would have been pretty painful to hit. Yeah, no, I don't want to summon uh, the fifth giant man. during this game, so. We're even footing, basically. Not to say, what, <laughs> I'll take you down one germ attack at a time. Okay, you still got your Mirror Force or Saku in deck. Okay, the germ, this thing is a pain in the butt. <laughs> um, okay, let's, uh, let, let's try to get rid of this thing once and for all, okay? Luster, not bad. Luster not bad. Dragon. Here we go. Yep. Okay, we finally got rid of it. We're still pretty Deal even because the 500 damage. Yeah, still pretty even there. Yeah, okay, go ahead. I draw. Yep, we're just germing it up. Um, <laughs> okay, let's snatch steal. Oh, yeah, that's annoying. Sounds you know, familiar. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna keep walling up here. Oh, that's... We'll set him. Let's see if you got a 1600 defense monster or a 1700 attack monster or not. <laughs> that is incredibly annoying. Okay, um... I think you simply don't have it. Go oh ahead. my gosh. I'm okay, willing to risk it for sets. the biscuit. It's the final game. I got to put it all on the line. It could pay off. Well, I'm going to dig for it and see if I have it. Okay, that's terrifying. 24 cards in deck, though. I mean, the heavy storm could be yeah, on the bottom. What are the chances? Three out of, you know, three, three out chance. of 27. I mean, it's pretty low. One in nine, 11%. I mean, there's no way I hit it. That's quick mess. Yeah, get rid of Jar Green. Mm -hmm. Yeah. There's absolutely no way I hit an 11% chance. No, and there's absolutely no way I'm playing into a heavy you storm. Are you judgment. kidding me? We haven't me. seen it before. Are you kidding me? I would never play oh. into a heavy storm. Okay, all right. I'll take it up. That's basically 1875 damage done, and that puts you in range for my Luster Dragon. That is true. Let's see if you have anything to stop him. Luster Dragon. Sakuretsu Armor. Mirror Force. No, I gotta, I gotta survive. I gotta bring my boy Call back. Call of <laughs> the haunted germ. <laughs> germ. It's oh it's just goodness. germ. I don't know what to tell you, man. It's it's the deck is all germs. <laughs> Whoops, all germs. Did you play like twelve of these or something? Like, what is happening? I don't know. Let's let's mirror wall though. Okay, mirror wall, respectable. Okay. <laughs> Fifty. <damage>. All right. <laughs> 50 damage. Nice. We are on some weird life points. 4150, 1875. 1875. Yeah. Um, I'm just gonna set a card. Of course you and are. That's all you can do. You know, I'll set, set two cards set, actually. Set. Wow, okay. okay. All right. You baited me. You baited me with the heavy storm. Well played. Well Come played. Come on, give me a card. Giant that's germ. On, giant germ, like one time. Oh my god. You're uh. 23 you're 13 cards in. Just giant germ. Yeah, actually. You don't want to attack? <laughs> attack? No, are you kidding me? Are you serious? Not this time. You're not gonna That attack. could be a, a giant soldier of stone. Giant versus giant. Oh well. That's not I'm good. I'm going to uh I'm gonna get rid of whatever that is. Oh two for one, not too bad. It avoids a two for one for me. Yeah, not too bad. Uh let's let's chill about let's let's think about this though before we make any hasty decisions. Oh, okay. Well I would also like to borrow that germ. No, you the, can't the you card cannot. of the game. You cannot get game with my own giant germ. Or can I, Pyramid Turtle? I feel like it's only fitting that we end with your own germ attacking you. Damn directly. it, dude. What 27 cards in deck every Every monster except giant germ like what the and hell every other monster is huge and you just have your little baby germ on the field. <laughs> ggs rocks and ggs dude that was a that was a really awesome set i actually really liked your deck like if thank you, you were you. able to actually draw something besides giant germ you probably would have won do you normally <laughs> do the, a little uh, a little deck comparison at the end of these videos yeah sure like uh share me your share yeah, me your yeah, deck. yeah let me uh, i'll send it in the discord right here so you can see my my germy deck Okay, so yeah, basically I just got a bunch of good, like it's a zombie plus like other good stuff. Yeah. Um, with like good back row and stuff. I didn't have like Mirror Force, unfortunately. So I was playing stuff like Shadow Spell, which never came up. Um, oh my God, I just realized was, I actually did forget to put the Torrential in here. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. I'm like, why do you not have I just thought I wasn't drawing it. Yeah, it's... <laughs>
<laughs> I'm not a GOAT format aficionado. It was so hard remembering which cards to put in the deck. Okay, fair enough. You know, Smashing Ground was the 40th card, and I was like... I feel like there was something here in my brain, but it was it was torrential. Well, these. fortunately, I have like done 13 of these or whatever, so yeah. I've just saved them in Master Duel, so I just go to the bookmark, so I can't exactly. forget anymore. But I forgot like widespread ruin for like 10 different episodes, so people have been getting on to me for that. So That's it's really good. easy That's to miss good. like one power staple, even if it seems super obvious, because you're just thinking about other stuff. Yeah, no, I definitely had some other ideas. I thought about Giant Orc with Skill Drain. I thought Skill Drain would be pretty good with all these high attack monsters. No, I think what I have learned from playing these older formats is that I always forget to put in like monsters more than 2000 attack. That is just a problem of mine. Like, <laughs> I almost think I should have played two Dark Necrofear. That's probably too crazy, but I yeah. thought that having cards like Bark and having removal like falling down meant that I didn't need large attack monsters, but it is uh, pretty key, I think, to at least play like, I don't know, a random... I could have played Skull Archfiend of Lightning. Honestly, I probably should have because that is an Archfiend card, so that would have been pretty good. Even just one copy of that would have helped. Yeah, it's especially hard against my deck because I can easily get out of 2400 Ryu Koki. Yeah. Like, pretty, if I draw Rat, Pyramid Turtle or Tribute Summon, I mean, I can, or if I bring it out from the grave, whatever, I can pretty easily get to it. Other decks, not as much, so you mm -hmm. probably would have done better, because, like, you had such good four-star summons, yeah. like, they were, like, impossible to contend with if you didn't have Floaters and Spirit Reaper and all the stuff I had. I think this has a pretty good matchup against any of the other type decks. I think that Fiends uh, are one of the, like you had said, are one of the only types that actually have support at this time in yeah. Yu-Gi-Oh's history. So right. I, I think this could have, uh, I think it did fare well. I think I'm pretty proud, you know, taking it a game five considering how strong your deck looks like but uh this was right. a lot of fun thanks for inviting me on well it was it was a great episode i always love when they go to the final game and it was a Absolutely. good time so thank you dz not as if for coming out and make sure you guys go subscribe to him on youtube if you guys have not already he does many other series including wheels if you subscribe. like stuff that's not go format go check that out as well so thank you once again for hopping on man you got anything last to say uh, thanks for letting me spin a wheel on a different person's channel. Amazing. All right, guys. See you guys next time. Catch Peace. you later. Shout out to Stone Info Show, Ernesto Deanda, America Deutscher, Brandon Cheney, Ian Moose, Junior Barding, Robert F., and Changalang. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.